and it was like this person they thought that they were gonna get over you they thought that you know it was it was all you that you were obsessed with them but now they're realizing that they love you that they're in love with you they only want you they're holding on to your energy they're trying to send you telepathic communication they could be sending you like song lyrics like they could be posting song lyrics on their social media and they know that you watch their page or or you follow them on social media and it's like the, these song lyrics that they're posting it's like they're talking about you leo this person all the music they hear reminds them of you okay very beautiful but it's like to the point where it's too much you know what i'm getting like they're drunk in your love leo they're realizing life without you leo is boring you're very interesting you have a lot of uh, passion you have a lot of desires you have a lot of dreams goals you're chasing after it you're going after it okay you have personality you're so unique hello my beautiful leos how are you welcome back to the channel we're gonna get started okay their current feelings for you okay we're gonna see how this person feels okay the person on your mind leo we're gonna see how they feel towards you cross watchers you are welcome this message is also timeless Personal reads are in the link tree link in the description box below. And with all that out of the way, we're going to get started here. My beautiful Leos, we have Embracing Change. Okay, we're going to see what the angels have. Wow, look at the bottom. I always see this as like Twin Flame or Soulmate. Talk to someone you trust, number six. Okay, Balance. And over here you have 22. Uh, master Number. You could be a Life Path number four, Life Path number two. right number two all about teamwork number four the builder somebody that builds what do we have here music okay oh that's so sweet electronics overload okay so the person on your mind leo leo this person it feels like they're in love with you like they want to have a baby with you look at the babies they want to like they want you to be the mom or dad of their of their children like they want you to raise the family to be the one to raise their family like they want you there you know music leo this person you know what i get with music here leo like this person all the music they hear reminds them of you okay very beautiful but it's like to the point where it's too much you know what i'm getting like they're drunk in your love leo like it's a lot like they may listen to the same song over and over again they may imagine, like, you know, themselves in a music video or something, and, like, it's a romance music video, and you're their romantic interest in that music video. But yeah, they, they, this person wants to be settled down with you. They don't want you to go anywhere. They, you know, electronics overload, they could be spying in on you as well, your social media yeah they could be constantly checking on your page oh so we have more look what was i saying leo number four emperor energy but i was also talking about life path number four wow the emperor energy is strong because you have aries there you can't make this up you're going to have number four, which is the Emperor. You're going to have Aries, which is Emperor energy. And you're going to have Mars, which is what the Emperor is ruled by, which is Aries energy. Also Scorpio energy, right? In traditional astrology. But, you know, you get the idea. This is, this is literally the Emperor. This is the Emperor. This is the Tower. This is the Fool. So we could see all of those cards. I'm going to shuffle the deck four times. So power number four. One. Two, three, four. Thank you so much, angels, ancestors, spirit guides, universe, galactic beings, ancient ancestors, elders, guide us in this read for my beautiful Leos. What messages do you have for them? This person, their current feelings towards my Leo. Truly grateful for your divine guidance and celestial light. Thank you. Wow. So right off the bat, we have, remember when we saw 
the four, we have the four of wands, but also look at the four of wands. This, look, there's a fourth one over here. You just can't see it. Well, you kind of can, right? It's just the border is there, but this is 1111, twin flame. A lot of you are dealing with a twin flame. Okay, let's focus in on it. What else? Nine of cups. I do see here there's been stagnation, okay? There has been delays. You know, you see how this person is sitting, his arms across against his chest, right? And, you know, spirit doesn't recommend we do that because then we block out our heart, ch our heart chakra. You know, so it's like this person has blocked out their heart because it's so... You bring up so many emotions, but deep down, Leo, this person... It's almost like... You and this person had an argument. You had a fight with them. And, like, you walked away. You're like, you're done with this. You're done. And it was like, this person, they thought that they were going to get over you. They thought that, you know, it, it was all you, that you were obsessed with them. But now they're realizing that they love you, that they're in love with you. They only want you. They're holding on to your energy. They're trying to send you telepathic communication. They could be sending you like song lyrics. Like they could be posting song lyrics on their social media. And they know that you watch their page or, or you follow them on social media. And it's like this, these song lyrics that they're posting, it's like they're talking about you, Leo. I'm getting something about Westchester Avenue. I'm getting something about Avenue. There's a Starbucks on an avenue somewhere. Somebody went to Starbucks these past few days. Somebody went to Starbucks. Somebody went to Starbucks or Dunkin' Donuts. Also, somebody may have spilled their coffee a little bit. Not like a whole lot. Somebody may have spilled their coffee. Somebody also went and got an acai bowl. Somebody was at Sephora. I'm getting channel messages here. Some of you are going to buy a car as well. Or some of you are looking... Some of you are looking to move into a van. Okay, so we have the Fort of Swords. This person's current feelings. Wow, temperance. They masturbate to you a lot, okay? They self-pleasure to you a lot. You may feel their energy. The Two of Pentacles. They're very scared of this connection, the love that, you know, they feel for you, okay? It's very unreal. I see here they're not really spiritual. Um, so they don't really believe in the twin flame soulmate, karmic soulmate. They don't really believe in that, okay? They don't believe in reincarnation, okay? They're very much still stuck in the matrix a little bit. I do see here that they're starting to accept this connection, Okay, they're starting to accept the truth about this, okay, and they're starting to come forward because they can't get over you, okay, the devil there, they have a lot of lust towards you. They fantasize about you two being together all the time, okay, they really want this union. It's like, they're really trying to figure out a way to do this because you're the queen of wands, you're very attractive, very beautiful. They know that you're a prize, that you're a one of a kind, that you can't be replaced, that they're never going to find someone like you, that you're one and only, you're, you're the GOAT, you're the greatest of all, of all of them, the greatest of them all. Three of Swords, yeah, their heart is very torn. Three of Wands, they are watching you. They feel like you may have turned your back on them, the Two of Wands and Justice. But it's because they were being, they, they just weren't committing. They just weren't being open and honest. They could have been a player. They could have been an F-boy, an F-girl. But I see here they're getting their karma. You know what I'm getting here, Leo? Like, this person has no distractions. They have nowhere to run. And now they have to actually confront their feelings about this. Yeah, the star. The star. You're their wish fulfillment. Also, you might be opposite personalities because the star is Aquarius energy. It's also Uranus energy. Uranus is a very rebellious planet. Basically, F you, I'm going to do what I want to do, and that's that. And that's what I see here, Leo, that you're going to do what you want to do. You're not going to put your life on hold for this person anymore. Yeah, King of Wands. But this individual, Leo, this individual, what did you do to this person, Leo? <laughs> this individual is in love. They're in love with you.
they are. They fantasize about you all the time. They see you as a star. Yeah, the hangman. Like, they just, it's like you take their breath away. You take their breath away. You're very beautiful, mind, body, and soul. Look at that. You're going to have a pair. Look at that. You're going to have a pair, literally. You know what I get? This individual is starting to wake up to this connection. And how special it is. You know what I heard? Please take me back. Some of you have told this person you're done with them. But... Mm, they have every intention of coming back. Yeah, Six of Cups. A lot of you have had a past life with this person. Okay, Leo? A lot of you have. Wow, there's the Emperor. There's the Emperor. We rolled number four. We got Mars. And we got Aries. There's the Emperor. That is the Emperor energy. The Emperor is Aries. It's card number four. Right? Aries, card number four. And it's ruled by Mars. There's the Emperor this person, some of you need to hear this, this person is your kingdom spouse, okay? This is your person. But you may have blocked them or they blocked you. There's a, there's an energy, uh, there's a discontinuation of the energy here, the chariot. They were refusing to move forward. They were staying stuck in old ways, old beliefs. Here you have the Ace of Wands. Spirit is giving a strong yes, because the Ace of Wands is the second best yes in the tarot deck, next to the Sun, which is the first. But what I see here, Leo, I see here that after a period of being cold and distant, this individual is going to come forward. They are going to come forward. Okay, this is going to be very shocking. Yeah, they were weighing this on their mind. Two of Pentacles again. And you have the Five of Swords. This was over and over in their mind. Like, they couldn't make a decision here on what they wish to do. They were at war. They were trying to fight this connection. But the thing is, you're very attractive. You're very beautiful. They couldn't, they couldn't hold back any longer. There's a huge fear here of you being with someone else. Yeah, this is your person, Leo, the King of Cups. Regardless if they're male, male female, um... You know, regardless of how they identify themselves, this is your person right here, okay? And they're very, very much deeply in love with you, okay? They are so in love with you, it's ridiculous. They're realizing it. Yeah, look at this. Look. They want happily ever after with you. They want to make it work. They want to come in, apologize. They want to show you, you know what? This person has an issue, <laughs> <laughs> and their issue is that they love you. Their issue is that you bring up all these emotions and they don't know how to deal with it. Okay? You open up this soft spot in their heart. You make them feel. Yeah, they're really scared, but the Knight of Pentacles there, they want to they wanna come forward. They want to build something long-term with you. Okay, the Ten of Wands and the Page of Pentacles, they're terrified that you're going to move away. Yeah, they're spying in on you. They're spying in on you. They don't want you going anywhere. Okay, they're very scared of that. But it's like, you may have felt like things are done. Like, there's no moving forward. Like, this person isn't offering you the commitment that you want. What you're looking for. But I do see this individual is coming back. They're coming back for more. Okay? For a lot of you, it's not finished. Potential. Yeah, this connection has a lot of potential. It has so much potential. But it's like, there was just roadblock after roadblock with sad news there. Could even be this person was a lot of stress to deal with. Yeah, you see birth. They want to have kids with you. They want to have a family with you. Okay? Boredom. They're, they're, you know, they're realizing life without you, Leo, is boring. You're very interesting. You have a lot of... Uh, passion you have a lot of desires you have a lot of dreams goals you're chasing after it you're going after it okay you have personality you're so unique and this person sees that they see that you're so different from everybody else you stand out from the crowd you do your own thing you are yourself boldly key mm, so i also get like with the key there like you're the key to their heart yeah you see the past you can't make it up, Leo. A lot of you were dealing with this person. 
but they're coming back. They're coming back. They're coming. They're coming your way. They're headed towards you, Leo. Yeah, see, look, I'm finished. The cards don't lie, Leo. It's unfinished between the two of you. There was just delays with Mountain there. So that is your read. If you want more information, check the link tree link in the description box and book a personal. But that is your read, my beautiful Leos. I hope you enjoyed this. I wish you the best of luck, and I wish you love and love.